In this video, I simply wanted to show the peak forces of different jump positions and also different jump heights. The slackliner has a weight of 58 kilos. The length of the slackline was 20 meter and the pretension 8 kN. One impressive thing is the number of force cycles that the material goes through. In this example, 40 jumps were performed in 50 seconds. If this was calculated up for one hour, there would be 3000 jumps and at the same time 3000 force cycles where the force increases from 8 to 12 kN. This is an important fact as for example aluminium is prone to this kind of cyclic load. So never use aluminium carabiners in your slackline, even less if you intend to jump line. Another interesting thing are the differences of the peak loads between foot jumps and body jumps. The loads in body jumps are always a lot higher compared to foot jumps and it doesn't really make a difference what kind of body jump is done. Butt bounce, chest bounce and also back bounce reach about the same loads.